waiting. Forget it. Just say it and she'll go home. Fine. You're right, Jackie. The Fonz could beat up Bruce Lee. <laughs> Thank you. Woo. Now, Michael, call me tonight at 8 o'clock. But that's when Chico and the man is on. I know. But I like it when you describe it to me. Oh, do a Chico impersonation. I don't think these guys really want to hear my Oh, sure. go ahead, We'd Michael. By all means, please. <laughs> all right. Looking good! <laughs> hey, Kelso, quick question. Why can't you date someone a little less annoying? Like who? What about Barbara Vanson? Uh, she's just as annoying as Jack. Yeah, but her boobs are huge. <laughs> so? Do you find that annoying? <laughs> <laughs> Pam Macy. Now she's got some knockers, baby. <laughs> True, but they're not bigger than Barbara's. Yeah, they are. But you're dreaming. It's like comparing Exodus and Deuteronomy, both of which have taught us very valuable lessons. <laughs> oh, hi, Dad. Damn dryer's broke. Ah, oh, nuts. I need my vice grips. Have you seen Pam in a tube top? It's like you're looking at the Grand Tetons. <laughs> in a tube top. Look, the issue isn't arm Pam's big, right? The issue is, are they bigger than Barbara's? Because Barbara's are bigger than the walls of Jericho, which, as we all know, came tumbling down, right? <laughs> Hello, Mrs. Foreman. Hi. Uh, Eric, did your father come down here? Yeah, he's fixing the dryer. Oh, dear. <laughs> you know, ever since the plant cut back his hours, he spent all his time fixing things. <laughs> things that don't need fixing. <laughs> things I need, things I use, things I love. <laughs> I gotta go hide the crock pot. <laughs> Sounds like your dad is losing it. Jeez. He's like this now. He's going to be a total head case if they shut down the plant. He's going to be this pathetic guy with breasts the size of watermelons. <laughs> is what Moses said to the Egyptians. Calzone, go home. <laughs>